Hello friend, in this video lecture, I am going to show that a minus b whole square, a square plus b square and a plus b whole square are in a b. So here writing a minus b whole square, writing the given, next is a square plus b square and here next is a plus b whole square so suppose here this is the first term and here second term and third term okay so here the difference of terms must be same so difference that is d that should be equal to a3 minus a2 a1 sorry a2 a2 minus a1 and here equal to a3 minus a2 so must be same and that should be constant so now here d1 that is calculating a2 minus a1 so here a square plus b square and minus a minus b whole square so here a square plus b square now a minus b whole square that is a square plus b square minus 2 a b so here a square plus b square minus that multiply with this all so minus a square minus b square plus 2ab so this cancel now here you can get d1 equal to 2ab and here the next is d2 that I'm going to calculate now checking another difference or you can write third term difference to second difference so let's write here d2 so d2 this time going to check the another difference a3 minus a2 third term minus second terms so here third terms is a plus b whole square and minus second a square plus b square second term is a square plus b square so a plus b whole square formula a square plus b square plus 2 a b and here multiply minus with this all so minus a square minus b square so this cancel again here that come to a b so here d1 equal to d2 equal to 2ab so here we can write difference differences of terms constant so difference of terms of constant so that above three terms are in AP if difference are same thing that is in AP because difference is the constant in the AP and if that uh, uh, not same thing this is the not in the AP so this is the same so that this is in the AP so with the help of difference we can easily check the terms are in AP or not so if the difference is same then this is in AP if not then not in the AP so this is the way we can so that this question so I hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you